Hey everybody, it's Dr. Fish, the mass scientist. Guys, today I made the do-it-yourself light-up DC motor Pringles fan. I'm going to show you guys it working first, then I'm going to explain it to you. Hit the switch on. Hit the switch off. This was a cool build, guys. Basically, for this, I took an empty Pringles container. I took a bottle of water. I put it inside of it like a brand new bottle of spring water. I put the Pringles lid back on. This blue light you see is actually a broken piece of plastic that comes from when a firefighter responds to a call. I've got one of their old broken lights. I filled it with blue finger lights. I actually, these two, holding it together, these are two of my wife's hair ties. I hot glue gunned a red finger light to the back of this vial that I found on the ground. I hot glue gunned the DC motor right to the top of the vial. I took six popsicle sticks and glued them together making a fan shape. And these, and I also put two green finger lights right on the side because sour cream and onion are my favorite Pringles and it, the Pringles container is obviously green. It's very cool guys. I really enjoyed making this and like I said after I glued the DC motor on remember when you're hooking up a switch positive to positive negative to negative on off on off it runs on 9 volts. I just hot glue gun the 9 volt battery right to the back of the Pringles container. And remember, again, hooking up a switch when you have the two wires. Positive to positive, negative to negative. That's all it is, guys. That's the do-it-yourself light-up DC motor Pringles fan. Always be original, creative, and explosive on YouTube, guys. See things that other people can't see and make cool stuff like this. You could set this fan anywhere, right next to your bed, or if you lose power or something, at least you'll be cool and have a little bit of light. Hope you guys enjoyed this video of this do-it-yourself, light-up, DC motor Pringles fan. Dr. Fish out.